What's good, you guys? Shiraco ZXP talking right now. Welcome back to another Pokemon Masters EX video. In the previous video that we did, we did, we did Cygna Suit Morty story. Today's video right now, it's the Johto, the Johto villain arc. I need to close the window. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Okay. Today's video right now, we're gonna do the the next arc, the Johto villain arc. If you have today's video, make sure that like button is posted to the channel. Now, in the previous video before this, well, not previous video, but before all this, we had ourselves the Elite Four, the Elite Four from Sinnoh Spotlight Scout, in which I didn't do because at that point, it, I'm most likely going to get him in the future if I were to do this. If any of them um, offered any of the Elite Four from Sinnoh, because most likely they could appear. In future ones, so I was like, you know what? I won't do this one. This one, I'm actually gonna skip out for once. Eh, they probably won't show up. There's Dalrek. I mean, you already got yourself the spotlight for Galar, so. So why not? Big money, no whammy. Survey says. Why, Bell? Bianca. Why? Always believe the potential. Leaf? No. We got a spark out of that one? Come on now. Big money, no whammy. Survey so says. First try! Let's go! You shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Yes, sir. All right, then. Let us begin. Giovanni. With Mega Kick. If it was, if we didn't have those passive skills, it wouldn't have been normal. Iron Tail, Poison Jab. Oh, man. Four? Four? Four and everything. Oh, my God. Oh, my. Giovanni's kind of narrow type becomes ground type moves never move, never misses. Oh my god. He might be OP. But it's a ground it's a ground sick type move. We need another poison, but okay. Alrighty then. This is indeed part one. There will be a part two. We'll figure out what the heck part two would be. On to Dex. There you go. I'm about to say, where the heck is it? It was like, oh wait, it's right over here. Apollo's interlude. I have no idea where the heck we're at. Okay, back over here. Here we go. Resuming operations. This is part one. Just like in the center one, we had part one, and then there's the next following month was part two, I believe. Resume operation, it said? Huh. <laughs> Previously in the Kanto arc, the Dynamax Gigatamax Snorlax Dynamax. <clears throat> Without a doubt, it is a tremendous power, strong enough to topple anything in its path. <laughs> this island certainly continues to intrigue me. Boss, the executives of Team Rocket are all present and counted for. It's an honor to be at your service again, sir. Your wish is our command, just say the word. You're looking sharp as ever, boss. So you all made it here. I'm sure you are aware of our situation. I, I forgot his voice. We're going to launch an operation to take control of the entire island of Pasio. In order to do that, we need more strength. A new kind of power, in fact. Get ready. I have much work for you to do. Yes, sir. First, I have something I need to finish. Soon, all of Pasio will be under the control of Team Rocket. What is going on? Hey, shiny ho! 
What's going on here? Who brings an Ombreon against two Ho-Hos? Who brings a Zatu against two Ho-Hos? Today's the day I pay you back for all the times you've beaten me. Come on, Ho! Don't hold back! Sorry, but that's not going to happen just yet. Dragonite, counter attack! Great battle! You almost had us! It doesn't matter. A loss is a loss. Still, that was very, really close. There were a bunch of moments where I even, even I was worried. Really? I couldn't tell at all. Yes. Well, if we let it show, we'd just be revealing to you what our weaknesses are. <laughs> exactly. You know, you know, your team did an excellent work, excellent job working together. It took Zatu and Ombria working together just to deal with Feraligator's strength. And I could hardly find an opening with that teamwork with your two ho were showing. <laughs> Hear that, Silver? Sounds like we make a pretty decent team. <sighs> I'll get you back for this eventually. You better be ready when I come back for another rematch. Hello? Excuse me? <laughs> Paulo? Yeah. Oh, it's you. What's up? Please? I'd like to ask you a question, Silver. I heard from Ethan that when you two first met, you were kind of a guy who'd do anything to get stronger. Things like stealing other people's Pokemon? Sorry. Paulo, maybe you shouldn't. Hey. Wait, Lance. Yeah, I did. What of it? Please? I was wondering why you changed your mind. You were doing things that way because you felt it would take make you stronger, right? If you kept going down that path, don't you think you might come out stronger for it? I'm not sure. Back then, I thought I could be the strongest trainer as long as I had the strongest Pokemon. But even when I had the strongest Pokemon, there were still people I couldn't beat. That's why I change. I still don't completely understand why I lost back then. But I think I'm starting to get it now. Does that have to do with relying on others or maybe connections? Yeah. At the very least, a strong connection with your Pokemon is a must. That said, I hate weak trainers who think they're big and tough as long as they're in a group. My bad. I see. Thanks, Silver. Sorry for asking that out of the blue. <laughs> Don't sweat it. It's fine. Giovanni also mentioned something about connections. Which means as long as I have a connection, I can use any means necessary to get stronger. <laughs> togepi? Hmm? Is that a Togepi? I don't see a trainer around. Why is it all alone? Hey! Hold on, it looks like it's in pain. A Dynamax Togepi? Hey, yo! Whoa! Is it Dynamaxing? A Dynamax Togepi. <laughs> wow. All right, we're back over here once again. Hey, Skyla. My allergies kick in, then my bad, my bad. Shut up. Move it. Move it along. Uh, not this one. Hold up. I know this is like... You're just only in for the rewards, that's it. Just to get all these. Back to the main story. Challenge Proton? Alrighty then. Alrighty then. Gold bats. Rock types! Up here! I think I have a certain group. Alright, Brock, you're up. Rock on deck. Our shiny Kabu tops. We're in. Here we go. Dun dun. dun. Okay, they changed it up. Hold up. Take care of this. Go, 
Let's go! Hits! Let's mash! Let's go! At this? Do something! Hang in there! Rock Tomb! How did- How did you miss? I'm about to say! Poison Fang. Let's see it. Why is it the well flying sink impact? Why are you using the well from that area? Rock Tomb! I'm counting on you. Rock Solid Rock Slide! Thank you. You defeat a proton. All right, next. Hmm, hmm. On my own. Well, doesn't that line sound familiar? What was up with that Togepi just now? It Dynamax out of nowhere. And then it just scampered away right after we took it down. Did you see how painted looked right after it approached us? I've seen something like this before. Yeah. With Eternatus? Yeah. yeah, when Eternatus came to Patio, it made a lot of other Pokemon Dynamax all of a sudden. Uh -huh. Everything was really chaotic because nobody knew what was causing it. But then Leon solved the problem by catching Eternatus? Yeah, that's what we thought, but if this is happening again, something else must be wrong. Yeah. That Togepi looked like it was having a rough time. I think it was being forced to Dynamax even though it didn't want to. Hmm. Let's go to Professor Billis' lab and figure out what to do next. And... So you saw a Dynamax Pokemon? Yeah. Yeah. Karen, Will, and Morty decided to stay there so they could keep an eye on things. Actually, I've already received reports of some incidents happening. Huh? Really? Yes. Not a lot, but they're on the rise. I already have red and blue on the case, as I thought we should do something soon before it gets out of hand. I'm pretty sure I know who's behind all of this too. Hey. It's Team Rocket, isn't it? They were spying on us earlier. They've been spotted looking around whatever a Dynamax Pokemon is reported. But they don't seem to have any control over those Pokemon, right? Hey. Oh wait, so that means... They're just forcing the Pokemon to Dynamax. Yeah. yeah, that's what I was thinking. I once saw Gyarados that had it evolved because Team Rocket forced it. It wanted a Rampage and looked like it was in a lot of pain. Team Rocket doesn't care about Pokemon. They just used them as tools. I won't let them get away with this. Me, Where are you going, Silva? <laughs> I'm doing this on my own. Hey. You don't want to come with us? Yeah. I'm not a fan of teaming up. I don't want to be like Team Rocket. They're just a bunch of weaklings who can't do anything on their own. <laughs> What's up with him? You seem a little on edge. Let him... Let him go. Wait, who said what now? The rest of us can team up. Hey. Sure, but where do we even start? Where's us? The main character. Oh, I know. Someone can you ask can help. She's a Pokemon professor from Galar, home of the Dynamax phenomenon. Sonia? Dun dun dun. Alright, here we go again. This time we're gonna beat him down. A remix to the remix. Nice. Let's go! 
Do your thing. How did you miss? Sheesh. Thank you. Next. Uh, the cruelest sca and scariest. Are we really meeting her here? Yeah. yeah, Professor Sonia is from Gala region, and she's done research on the Dynamax phenomenon. That's why we like to ask her about what's going on, but we're worried that Team Rocket might overhear our conversation if we meet up with her in town. I see, so that's why you chose such a secluded area deep in the woods. Yeah. Exactly. Will went, Will went to fetch the professor, so there shouldn't be any risk of her getting kidnapped along the way either. Yes. We also had Chris stay with Professor Bella, so we know she'll be safe too. Right. We won't make the same mistakes we did last time. This time, we're going to finish the job. Hey. Sorry to keep you waiting. Sonia! Where's the main character? Where's us? Professor Sonia. We got a few, lo lost a few times. It's dark around here, so everything looks the same. Thank you. Thanks for bringing her here, Will. No problem. Did you bring the thing I asked you about, Professor? <laughs> yep, I managed it somehow. This machine is something I've been working on for a while now. But since you need it, I was able to complete it in record time. Ta-da, I call it a Dynamax Sync Pair Power Spot Detector. <laughs> what a tongue twister. What does it do? It detects a spot where gathered particles are showing increased activity. Uh, in other words, it's able to find Pokemon that are on the verge of Dynamaxing. Hmm. Oh really? So if we go to the spot showing the most activity, there's a good chance that that's where the Team Rocket hideout is located. Yeah. Exactly. That's amazing, Professor Sonia. I can't believe you put this together in such a short amount of time. <laughs> it may look a bit rough around the edges, but I can assure you it's got a pinpoint accuracy. Right. Okay, let's give it a go then. Where's the where's the on switch? You made it quite an annoying scene, I see. Who's there? Our boss is busy running a grand experiment. We can't let you interfere with that. I am Proton, an executive of Team Rocket. I won't let you flip that switch. Oh my gosh, Proton, you're so cool. I guess you were followed, Professor. What? Me? Yes. Well, I actually did notice that. Really? I thought it would be smarter if we dealt with it once we get back together with the group. He wasn't showing any signs of attacking at the time. So this mighty Team Rocket executive had just tailed you instead of facing you head-on in the battle. How spineless. Excuse me, what did you just say? You'll be sorry once Proton gets serious and takes you out in a second. We'll beat you to the ground and send you home in tears. Sorry, but we're in a hurry. I'll have to ask you to leave. The head on crow! Alrighty then. Whatever, I still bought us some time. I don't expect us to I don't expect you to understand the grand mission our boss is going to accomplish anyway. Proton's a team record executive and he wasn't just all talk. Yes. Yeah, Team Rocket is definitely getting stronger again. No. They're a dangerous mat bunch. I'll stay with Professor Sony for extra protection just in case. Right. Okay then, then the rest of us should find their hideout before it's too late. Meanwhile... Alright, round three. This time, don't miss. Bonjour, rock slide. I'm counting on you. 
Yes, sir. Just don't miss. 90% chance. You defeated Proton. Let's go. Hey, we got some eggs. Infiltrate the rocket hideout. In the ice area? <clears throat> the hideout is here of all places? Yeah. According to the machine, yeah. I wonder if Silver's here already. <laughs> he might have already infiltrated that hideout. I told him what we know. Let's have him decide how he wants to go about it. <laughs> oh, hey. We've been waiting for you. I must say, I'm a bit surprised you barged in here all of your own. Are you brave or just reckless? I'll put that to the test. You shall face Giovanni, the greatest trainer. Still no comments? That was truly a tense fight. You have won. I have little choice, it seems. I will relinquish Pasio for now. But Team Rocket will never fall. Never forget that all Pokemon exist for Team Rocket. You're not fooling anyone. Show's over. What? Your patrol, the Team Rocket executive. Spill it. Where's Giovanni? <laughs> I guess my cover is blown! My disguise was perfect! You get props for seeing it through it! But my losing to you won't change a thing! That door is locked shut! You can try all you like, but it won't open unless I see the password! It only reacts to my voice. <laughs> uh. Hey. Shush, Hunchcrow! Don't say the password this time, okay? If you keep quiet, I'll give you a shiny toy ring. Oh, I forgot. I guess you only like shiny things when you were still a Murkrow, huh? Look at you now, all big and strong. It's making me tear up. Face it, kid. You hit a dead end, and you're not going anywhere. <laughs> hey, oh, Giovanni. Oops. Ah, oh, man, I got so excited I accidentally shouted out the password. You really don't know when to stop talking. No turning back. Now I'll stop you before you get to the boss. No matter what it takes. In the end, you're still resorting to outnumbering your opponent. This is why I hate you guys. But if I waste my time on this, Lance and the others might get into Giovanni verse. Where's that laugh coming from? Hmm? How long have you been here? Silver, we are here to help. You can go on ahead. My father and I will take care of everyone here. Let's help each other out. I don't need help from anyone. Stop interfering. You're the only one who's going to take down Giovanni, aren't you? Do you really have the time to waste time? <laughs> Fine. Okay, prepare yourselves. Ah, uh, this can't be. Oh wait, I dropped your body disguise already, didn't I? Don, I guess the best I can do is stop the two of you then. 
Huh, you think we'll just let you do that? Prepare to fall victim to our intricate style and sinister techniques. Our bond as a family will prevail. Meanwhile, we've got you cornered now. Why don't you put an end to this evil nonsense of forcing Pokemon to Dynamax? Cornered, you say? I'm afraid you're just a tad too late for that line. What? Giovanni, welcome to my hideout, champion. <laughs> Where to now? Challenge Archer Part 1? Let's see it. Another flying type? And this is just part Houndoom, of course. Will he Mega Evolve too? No, we already got Karen for that one. Dire hit all. It ain't gonna kill. I said the next thing you know it does. And it miss! I'll let you do your thing, I'ma sneeze. <coughs> I'ma sneeze again. Do your thing! How many you got? Oh, we're flinching already. Flamethrower. One more. Before we hyper beam it. Anytime now. Anytime now. Dark sink beam. Alright, finish him off. Don't miss! Thank you. Victory! X. One or many. We're getting end of part one already. You certainly took your time. You've given me enough time to complete my objective. Your objective? <laughs> Bit slow on the uptake, aren't you? We're talking about Dynamax Sync Pairs. What? You become a Dynamax Sync Pair? Yeah. Indeed, we're different from those other Pokemon that were Dynamaxing spontaneously all over Paseo. Now I have a Pokemon that will Dynamax on command. <laughs> we con con conducted some experiments of our own based on Professor Bella's research materials and now we have the results. I took some of the inspiration for the sync pairs on Paseo who wear singlet suits as well. They're fascinating outfits. When you wear them, you can feel a stronger connection to your partner Pokemon. Wait, so you found a another Pokemon willing to accept the mouse in your heart? Just like Mewtwo did? Having trouble accepting that? See for yourself then. Experience the power of the evil that bonds us together. Needle King. Dynamax! Low frame rates! How did you get lost? What? The ground is shaking! The hideout is about to collapse! <laughs> How glorious! This is the true power of the Dynamax Sync Pair. Such overwhelming strength, this is what I was trying to achieve! I can't believe he just destroyed his hideout with a max move. Mega Evolution and Dynamax together are unbelievably powerful. I see you're incapable of doing anything by yourselves, as always. Silver! What a joke. 
Those traitors took out your horde of grunts earlier. So their Pokemon were already tired. You think you could talk big after beating an opponent that's already been weakened for you? That is simply what a, an organization does. Indeed, bringing together individuals is more efficient and always you to wield much more power. There's no reason why we shouldn't make use of such power, do you not understand that, child? Big talk for cowards who can't do anything without Giovanni around. Face it, you're just too weak to work alone. Even a child like me could see that. Why can't you? How dare you say that? You have no idea what we've been through. I suppose you got it stronger enough to back up that argument, have you? Of course, while you were all pretending to be friends, I was busy training. I could take care of this all by myself. This is how it should have been from the start. We'll settle this once and for all, old man. I guess a Dynamax? And with that, we have concluded part one of the Johto content. Like, comment, subscribe, Shiraka's XTV, and I'm signing out.